All right, everybody. I want to go into a little bit of the basics here for all the new people who uh, who are new to cryptocurrencies and explain how to establish a Coinbase account and why it's so important and why it's actually the most difficult step. Um, it's been in my experience um, getting new people into cryptocurrency. Uh, Coinbase is regulated like a bank. It's uh, it for all intents and purposes, it is a bank. Um, and it is the on-ramp and off-ramp where money can come from the legacy finance system from your bank into the cryptocurrency space and then back so you can buy it and then sell it um, and then have those funds deposited back into your bank account so it's Im it's important to establish that I was around for the 2017 uh, crypto bull run and I remember hearing horror stories of people it, it taking days for people to establish new accounts um, and connecting it with their bank account because Coinbase was setting up you know thousands of new accounts daily and that's just a backlog so um, it's important to have this set up and established uh, ahead of time um, before the mania and the craze and everything happens and it's important to understand that keeping that account functioning keeping that password that you use in a safe place um, and making sure that you're actually able to set uh, to to buy and sell cryptocurrencies using um, a, a platform like coinbase uh, is is very important and when you set when you set up coinbase initially they're going to ask you a bunch of questions um, they're going to they're going to ask for a picture of your driver's license and they're going to ask for your bank account information and i would do two things i would I would set up, um, I would connect Coinbase to your bank using your account number and your routing number. And I would also um, set up the ability to purchase using your debit card. Because if you just use the routing number, connect it directly, and you buy cryptocurrency like Ethereum um, that way, then Coinbase will hold that Ethereum until the whole transaction clears, right? And that takes six days. Is, is what I've been seeing people bought it and it's like I can't do anything with it for six days but if you buy it using your debit card um, it, it's immediately available for you to send off of coinbase onto your personal wallet and that's another thing that I want to cover today I want to cover how to establish uh, a personal wallet so that you control your cryptocurrency and, th and that's another part of, you know, the, the revolution of, of cryptocurrency, because once you because if it's sitting on Coinbase, then they control it and you don't control it. So let me go into how to get your your secret word set up and establish a, uh, a personal account with, say, MetaMask, because we're going to be talking about uh, buying and sending Ethereum. Um, and not so much Bitcoin here on this channel. Um, so let me do that real quick. And I'm just going to I'm, I'm going to use a, a video that Richard Hart made um, to show you how to do that real quick. Here's how you can set up a wallet for Hex. Open your browser. Type MetaMask.io. Hit enter. In this case, click Get Chrome Extension because we're using Chrome. Click Add to Chrome. Click Add Extension. Wait for it to download and install. Now that it's installed, click Get Started. Let's make a new wallet. Create a wallet. Click. I don't like sharing data. I click No Thanks. You should choose a strong password. I'm choosing a weak one because this is just a demo. Now, if you click this box, these are your secret words. Since these are public now, these are useless to anybody to use. We're going to save them into a notepad document so that we can put them in in the next screen. Click Next. Twist Fossil About Drink. Twist Fossil About Drink. 
Unaware smile cause caught. Unaware smile cause caught. Forest expose key physical. Forest expose key physical. You shouldn't read these out loud. I'm just making it easy for you guys. Um, click confirm. And that's it. You're done. You now have a wallet that works for Hex and is also an Ethereum wallet. You can click copy here and get your address and take a look at it. There's your address. Congratulations. All right, so that was Richard Hart explaining how to set up a MetaMask wallet to uh, receive Ethereum. Um, Hex can be stored on that wallet as well. And I wanna point out that this is, uh, for this particular uh, seed phrase, is the Ethereum address that this seed, this seed phrase produces. And it's a complicated kind of string of letters and numbers that you'll, you should never have to write down. You should always be able to copy and paste it or scan a QR code. But it's important to understand that that's your public, uh, uh, public key where anyone anywhere in the world can send you any, any coin or token that um, lives on the Ethereum blockchain. And so that's what that does. The other thing that I wanted to talk about is is uh, about like the basics of it is when you when you when you first send a cryptocurrency um, off off of an exchange to your wallet um, or back to somewhere and you're not used to it you really want to practice doing that until you get comfortable doing it and I would rec highly recommend that you send a test amount because if you if you're sending if you're not sure where you're sending your cryptocurrency um, it, it could get lost forever there, these transactions are not reversible so I would send a test amount uh, at first and make sure that it actually goes where you want it to go and then you can send the rest of the, the bulk of the funds that you wanted and I would practice doing that um, until I got comfortable which might take you know a couple weeks so uh, definitely plan on doing that so that's going to do it for this video. I just want to reiterate, establishing a Coinbase account is very important and it needs to be taken care of and you want to do this before the bull run. We're coming into a bull run and um, you, you don't want to be uh, one of the thousands of new accounts per day. Uh, Coinbase's uh, customer service <laughs> is horrible um, but it is, and, and they know it and they don't care. Um, this is a service that you absolutely need, and that's just how it is until, you know, we're we're in a completely DeFi world and we're not even worried about sending uh, cryptocurrency back to our legacy bank account because I can just pay everyone in Ethereum or Hex or Bitcoin, and that'll be just fine. So um, this, these are the basics. These are the most important fundamentals. Of, of how to get started in cryptocurrency. It's not that difficult once you practice it and make no mistake, it's coming. You're gonna need to do this one way or another and the sooner you do it, the better. All right guys, um, there's gonna be more to come. I'm going to be making videos about um, how to stake Hex, how to buy Hex, um, um, and all kinds of videos on what Hex does and what it's about. And so stay tuned. All right, take care guys.